Hey everybody out there in TV land, Eddie, the Tattooed Realtor, coming to you live from my lovely backyard here in Margate, Florida on this beautiful sunny day. If you see me sweating, it's a little hot outside, but I like shooting outside if I can, just because of the natural light. And plus, I love my floral shirts, so you know, one goes, <laughs> goes hand in hand with the other. So before we get started in this awesome video, be sure to give that subscribe button a click. Where subscribership is growing continually and it's great to see that the content that I'm creating is actually being able to help others. That's the whole point. My whole point of this is to help create content for each and every person to be able to use to grow their real estate business wherever they're at. Be it in, you know, South Florida or California or New York or Ohio or wherever you're at. Feel free to click that subscribe button. I'd love to gain you as a subscriber. Try to create really rich content as much as possible. And if you ever have a question, feel free, call, text, or email. I'm always here, leave a comment. I talk to realtors on a weekly, if not daily basis about different marketing ideas or strategies. I'm always here to help. So let's jump straight into this video. This video is gonna be short and brief, but it's gonna be about the lovely world of leasing. Yes, I said it, leasing. Leasing or renting is a fabulous place to, or a component, well it's a place to start if you're a beginning realtor, but it's a great component to have in your real estate business. Why? Having a leasing system built into your real estate business is great because leasing um, allows you to get cash flow pretty quickly other than um, you know selling property. It can take a very short period of time to do leasing. If you start developing a system like I have around leasing communities, it could be almost within a matter of days depending on how that corporation is structured and they pay the realtors. Leasing is a great component also to help you build your, as I said in a previous video, your thousand super fans or your super fans, your brand advocates, whatever number you're trying to go after because you're constantly getting in touch with them a lot more and you're going, helping a lot more families in a lot quicker base because a lot of people are looking to move all the time. Also with leasing, one thing you have to remember is that I think that in my opinion, there's a lot less variables, especially if you screen appropriately. If you ask the right questions, I have various videos that talk about the, the need to screen appropriately. Man, it's sweating a little bit, but forgive me. The screen appropriately, because if you screen appropriately, it'll save you that much time in the long run about how you can assist that customer. So you have to learn how to screen. Also with leasing programs, it allows you to have a great customer relationship straight from the get go. A lot of times leasing turns into buyers or turns into sellers. I could tell you story upon story. Um, I'll give you one here for example. I had a couple properties out there that I was marketing and we could talk about marketing leasing in a totally different video. And what happened was I got a phone call and Chris gave me a call and he wanted to sell his home because he had a short sell it because of what was going on in his particular situation. And we were able to assist him in getting in, him into a rental, actually a really nice rental, and also able to assist him in short selling his home at that particular time. So you never know what could come from that leasing experience. So don't shun list leasing if you haven't given it a shot. Be sure to integrate it into your real estate business as a cog in the machine. I believe 100% that your real estate business, or any business for that matter, should have a couple different verticals that would allow them to get income. Because let's say selling's not doing so hot right now, but you have a good buyer's funnel. Okay, good. But let's say buyers and sellers aren't doing too hot, but you have a good leasing funnel. Even better to have multiple funnels, build a team. I'm constantly helping other realtors create these systems behind their real estate business and being a mentor or a coach to them because that's what I like to do. I like to be able to assist people in achieving their dreams and goals, be it in business, life, whatever the case may be. For this particular situation, we're talking about real estate, of course. So leasing system is vitally, to have, vitally important to have. I have done other videos about leasing, so I'll be sure to add them in the description below. But please, don't negate the, the idea of having a leasing program built into your real estate business. We can go and talk into greater de depth and detail about what that leasing program would look like, but don't ignore it, okay? So just my thought for today, leasing programs, definitely important cog to machine, uh, ah, definitely important to have that cog in the greater machine. And if you're just getting started in real estate, congratulations. I recommend that you also think about using leasing as a predominant way to start your business because it'll help with cash flow. It'll get you through a lot of different transactions in a very quick period of time. I used to do between, oh man, I think I used to do it between like five to six leases a week when I first got started about eight years ago because I was going through them so quickly. 
Um, and it was a great experience. It was learning and we were able to keep cash flow, keep our family afloat for that time being. So I highly recommend it. So if you have any questions about leasing, feel free to reach out. If you need help building that program, more than happy to help any way I can. Once again, my name is Eddie Acevedo, otherwise known as a tattooed realtor. Thank you so much for watching this video. Be sure to give that subscribe button a click. If I can ever be of assistance, if you're down here in South Florida, feel free to call, text, or email. Always looking to help any and everyone, anyone and everyone I can, um, just to reach and achieve the real estate goals. So I hope you guys have a great rest of the day and I'll catch you later. Bye.